So I'm in the water cube in Stockholm with some you <laughs> some Yukta, sorry. <laughs> Please tell a little bit about yourself and what you're doing here. Um, I work for the International Water Management Institute. Uh, we have a stall here at Stockholm. Yeah. We have come to many Stockholm Water Weeks mm -hmm. before, but this is my first time. Uh, we're pro promoting a couple of different things at our booth today. One is a report on water storage, which mm -hmm. basically talks about how a range of storage options are, mm -hmm. are required and, and will really help to adapt to mm -hmm. climate change. The other thing is a new book called Out of Water, which is for a general audience and basically talks about how we are going to have to deal with water scarcity in the future and how it's going to impact agricultural production in different parts of the world, um, the management options that we should consider to sort of deal with this, with changing water availability. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and so that's another thing we're promoting at our booth. And then we have another book, which is on wastewater irrigation and health, okay. which basically talks about how to minimize the risks of wastewater uh, use in agriculture, the implications on health. Mm -hmm. um, and that, I guess, is most relevant to the topic of this year's Water Week. Yeah. And so I think Emi is also involved in a couple of sessions here in this week. Yeah, we had a session on Sunday. Okay. That was the main one. Which was, uh, I think, it was also on wastewater, and uh, I think there was a the, there was the Pi Drexel uh, scientist mm -hmm. who works on this topic mm -hmm. presented, um, and I think there was also a launch of a new UN report, uh, World Bank report that um, in IMI scientists contributed to quite a bit. Okay, so first time in Stockholm. First time in Stockholm. What's your impression? Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah. I'm glad it's not freezing. No, that's the <laughs> that's for sure. And and what are you expecting for the rest of the week? Are are you, uh, I mean, do you have any new insights or expectations of, you know, learning? Yeah, I hope to attend a couple of other sessions yeah. this week. Uh, I don't know actually a lot about water quality. It's not an area I'm familiar with. So, yeah. so lots what, of new so, stuff. So, so what is your passion in water? Oh, I'm, my background is in gender, and so I'm really interested in equity and water, and access to water, and mm -hmm. and poverty issues specifically. Okay. So if, if you just have just your message to the world on water, what would it be? Um, I think we just have to understand that um, everything we try to do has different impacts on different kinds of people. Yeah. And, um, you know, social relations determine a lot of how how well and how successful uh, how how much people actually get and how much yeah. access people actually get yeah so no matter how perfect we think a plan is things always change so we need to really be quite focused and uh, we need to really understand how things work mm -hmm. within societies exactly. if we really want to make sure that what we do has an impact on on those who need it the most really okay well, thank you very much. Thank you. Enjoy the rest of the week. Thank you.